How to determine the payback for your solar panel investment part 1 of 3. Solar panels installation buying or making solar panels is an investment you make toward a better future. For every investment you make, you have to find out the risks involved and its potential payback. This is the same whether you invest in equity, put your money in the bank or use it to buy a solar energy system. Even if you know or have an intuition that investing in solar panels for your home is a great decision, it doesn't hurt to estimate how this decision can help you financially. First, let's look at the big picture. There is an upfront cost for owning PV panels, and this hurts initially for many of us, at least. Thankfully this is about all you'll pay for the next 30 plus years, as long as your solar panels last. When you add up the total cost of your utility bills for the next 30 plus years, your perspective will change. This is because it will almost always be more expensive. To make things worse, energy rate only goes skywards over time. And the bill you're paying now will probably double in 30 years time. Do you remember what the energy rates were 30 years ago? Next, in order to know how long it takes to recoup your investment, we have to consider the total upfront cost for a commercial solar panel setup. Here is a list of things you have to invest in. 1. Equipment cost. This includes your PV panels, inverters and rechargeable batteries, if applicable. This cost can be paid in one lump sum, or you can get financing from the bank or the supplier. When a loan is involved, you also have to include interests to the total cost. 2. Installation cost. You can hire a professional installer or you can do it yourself, if you are handy with these tasks. Installers can charge you an hourly rate or quote you a net price for the installation job. 3. Maintenance cost. Your lucky solar panels need very little maintenance. And damages are usually paid for by the warranty. 4. Miscellaneous costs. There are other costs involved. You may have to pay for permits and fees to carry out solar panel installation on your roof. Although rare, there may also be taxes involved as the value of your home appreciates due to solar installation. When your solar panel has reached the end of its lifespan, you may also have to pay people to haul your equipment away. Fortunately, the costs above are defrayed by subsidies and rebates that you may be qualified for. Your utility company, the state and federal government or even the manufacturer often provide these benefits. Part 2 of the series talks about how long it takes to recoup your investment in the light of the above costs. The article also illustrates how much savings you can expect by installing solar panels at home. Read on. View Part 2 here. HTTP www.diysolarpanelswrld.com slash how dash to dash determine dash the dash payvack dash for dash your dash solar dash panel dash invest ment dash part dash two dash of dash three Facebook related posts. Why are solar panels the best investment for your home? Survey your household energy usage before installing solar panels creating an energy efficient house, a primer on why you should do it and how. <laughs>